Hello everybody and what is up? My name is Shangali and this is Creed. Rise to glory. Let's get swinging. you want me to go there okay so no cutscene just throw me right into the action I like it <laughs> the lion hey, at least there's a picture of me somewhere Delphi. Right. I gotta hit harder than that. Hey, I was thinking maybe I could come down to the gym. Maybe you could show me some moves. Nah, I ain't showing you that. Nobody is. Man, I don't just give me a chance. My mom will never hear about it. Just, just help me out here. Fine. I gotta try to wait for you at the gym. But. I'm at the gym. Oh, I guess I'm not at the gym. No, oh, still at the gym. Hey! Waiting for me. Alright, Donnie, show me what you got. Uh, so yeah, this used to be the game that I played for cardio. Used to, not because I found a better game, but because... I just haven't been doing cardio. No cutscene. No okay. uh. Let's go over the basics first. Get the fundamentals down, and the rest will be easy. Ah! Okay. Yeah, defend Pi, putting her clothes in her face. That's me. That's exactly what I look like. See, now you guys know. I'm glad. I'm glad to do the reveal. It's actually we're even. Uh, see, at the same time. This. I'm really bad at this. So, uh, dude, there's no way that he's going down far enough for that. Before you step into the ring, we're going to make sure you've got what it takes. This is day one of training. When we're done, the fight will be the easiest part of all of this. Stamina goes out. You can see the blue fist is me. Oh, 
Am I just gonna freak out until... Rage monster! Right, that's okay. So I will say I wish that they didn't do this. People have a built-in stamina system. We don't really need the forced one on top of it. And I feel like that would encourage you to play this more and get in shape. And with like DLC of a few extra characters or a few more options or I don't know, create your own fighter. We had no stamina system. This could have been like the go-to boxing game. Fuck. You fought hard out of the ring to get here. Now fight hard in, in the ring. Win. Oh, close enough. Yeah, it's cockeyed. Does it follow me? No? Okay. Those, uh, those warm-ups are good. Hit training. Actually, the bo even shadow boxing in general is good hit training. That's why it works for cardio. I forgot where they ranked it. It's like tennis. Which doesn't sound impressive unless you've played tennis. Are there... Ooh. Wait, that means you only have two stamps. Well, yeah, I just thought there was going to be more of an announcement. Hey, Hollow Creed, this is, this is my crowd. This is the crowd that I got to deal with. This is your fault. Let's keep this above the belt and inside the ring. Ready? The fight starts as soon as you touch gloves. All right. Hungry for this start one, with. folks. The fight has begun. Don't let up. Wait for an open. One, two, three, four. It's like that. His opponent will have to try something else. Creed isn't letting anything through. What a match! Top time. I think that was a new record. Which is weird because I definitely feel like that was harder. He only block six, that's cool. Block nine. Woo! Eat it! But again, yeah, he is the easiest. These are so long. I'm definitely gonna have to cut some of these out. Trim them down. Have I not? Have I not fought it? Welcome to another round of The Distance with Nick and Travis. I'm Nick. And I'm Travis. And this is what's happening in the world of boxing. Let's start with this week's highlights. Kevin the Bank Grier suffered his first career loss going up against the operator Bobby Nash. Ha, what a fight for Nash, huh? If you can call it that. Over in three oh, rounds. Oh, there it is. Guess you could uh, say he broke the bank. <laughs> in other news, Danny Wheeler continues to rise up the ranks of the boxing world, racking up his 27th win. Making a total of 16 by knockouts. Oh, that's right. What a fighter. You think he could take out Nash? That's getting a little long in the tooth. You know, it's kind of tough to say. Wheeler has the skill for sure. Probably one of the best defensive boxers in the game these days. No one can counter a punch like Wheeler. And Wheeler, of course, is boxing out of the world-famous Delphi Gym, home of former American champion. 
Uh, but these days, a lot of people consider Nash to be at the top of the American boxing world. All the more reason for Wheeler to knock him out. Yeah, well, him? we'll have to wait, though, since next in line for a shot of the champ is none other than Liverpool's most wanted, the gangster himself. Eh, alleged gangster. An alleged gangster, pretty Ricky Sorry. Conlon. Hey, Nick, what do you think about Conlon? I think we're in for a hell of a fight. 30 wins, 25 KOs. You know, he's certainly the future of this sport. Yeah, much tougher than the what? bank, I'll say that. That fight is coming up in New York in just a few months, folks. Oh, I can't wait. Uh, me neither. Oh, well, folks, that's the bell. And this has been The Distance with Nick and Travis. You all have a great week. Until the next round. <laughs>between boxing rounds you can come and train on any of the equipment talk to him to continue the story oh there's a I was wondering I was like I think they're short a few pieces Save a few pictures of me. Where's my... I'm so lost. Where's my front? I move around so much. You can kind of see the... That's where I'm from. Half. The other half. I'm trapped. This is my life now. You can also like ski. Oh, stay in the center. Okay, sorry, sorry. It's like skiing. Bunny hop. Uh. Uh. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, show me what you got. Wait, I wasn't ready. Did we? Did we start it? No. Do is hit the So 13 is still good. I don't, I don't know who I'm fighting. You fought hard out of the ring to get here. Now fight hard in there and win. Yeah, all right. So it gives me this box to move in. The moment in. you've all been waiting for is finally here. Before I'm not. Who's ready to fight? In the blue corner, Axel El Tigre Ramirez. 1996. In the red corner. Silver. Might not even been you. Hey, at least there's some more people. Hi.
How you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, I know how to walk. Put your hands together for our fighters, ladies and gentlemen. The time has come! Let's keep this above the belt and inside the ring. Ready? The fight starts as soon as we touch gloves. You gotta love twins. <sighs> That's the starting belt, and the fight is underway. Creed slams hard into his opponent. Ain't letting him hit me. Still less than around. Woo! Yeah. Let me hear it. <laughs> block 12%. Twice as worse. That block slightly more. Whew, crap. And that's why it's good cardio. Two more months. Look at us go. Leaf hey Frogging. Fight fans, welcome to another round of the distance with Nick and Travis. I'm Nick. And I'm Travis. And this is what's happening in the world of boxing. Headlining the boxing news this week is the continued rise of Danny Wheeler. Yeah, that makes what, 29 wins? 29 wins, 17 by knockout. The man is a powerhouse. Really, almost unparalleled in the sport. I mean, who could he even fight at this point? Well, that leads that us me? to our next topic, Trav. Our two top fighters in the light heavyweight class, Pretty Ricky and Bobby the Operator Nash. Oh, oh, oh talk about an upset. Am I Danny oh, Wheeler? Not for me, man. I had money on Conlon. Just an outstanding match. I mean, 12 whole rounds, only to finish it with a stunning knockout. You know, I think that makes Conlon the best pound-for-pound -pound fighter out there. The man is running out of people to clobber. True enough. You know, I've heard rumors Nash might be retiring this year. What a loss. It certainly is. Either way, Bobby Nash is now recovering. They say he has a broken jaw, possibly some permanent damage to his eye. He's not in any state to fight for at least a half a year. Well, hopefully he's all right. Hey, Bobby, if you're listening, we wish you a speedy recovery, man. Yes, we do. Anything else going on? This week in Mexico, we've got the Underground Brawlers Championship, a 12-hour-long, unsanctioned boxing event. Fights will be broadcast online starting at 10 o'clock Central and be running pretty much all day. Mm -hmm. You know, I may tune into that. I heard Dwayne Reynolds is going to be there. Oh, the Rhino. That guy is still fighting? It says here he'll be up against Donnie Johnson. Actor? Nah, some no-name underground fighter. Eight wins. Too bad for him, though. Rhino is up to... Oh, Jesus, 29 wins, 25 knockouts. Well, good luck, Donnie. Oh, folks, that's the bell. We gotta Thank go. You. This has been The Distance with Nick and Travis. You all have a great week. Until the next round. I think that's what it is. I think I'm Donnie Johnson. The no-name. The pigeon-toed no-name. My body just stick. Gonna fall. Whew. All right, I can't just go into another training. I need to turn on the fans in my apartment and get a drink. So I took a peek at it out of curiosity, 
And yeah, I've played this game so much that I am two trophies away from a platinum. Uh, I need to do a PvP match because I've never done one at all. Even if I like boxing, I don't I don't like fighting other people. And I need to dodge ten times in a single fight because I can barely dodge once on purpose, let alone ten. But maybe if I went against scraps on easy, it's like legit. There's a trophy for getting into that swarm mode where you're like tired and like are struggling and they're just throwing a whole bunch of punches at you. There's a trophy for swarm mode with one hand and then the other one behind your back. I've done that. Easy mode like, uh, against against scraps because it's, it's scraps, man. Like, it's scraps. It's like, put me into a fight with Lucas. Freaking Lucas. So there's seven chapters. I think I could just do this as a one-off, but I, I do like this game. So I think I'm going to try and do it in two parts. And then they have some DLC characters that you won't come across in the story, obviously, because they're DLC that I have. Maybe I'll put their, those, those in their own video. Or I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Don't you know that already? Bird? Whoa. 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 All right. Show me All what right. you got. All right. Let's go then, man. Oh, you said I I forgot. It's the it's the ghost trainer. Okay, sorry. You're, you're, from a different angle, it, you were talking shit. So, you know what I mean? Like revving me up. I get it though. I get it. Team Team Delphi. Slightly over. It's like Dragon Ball Barrage. reading me in the right place. And why am I not tr turned towards the items? Okay, I'm so off-center. Where the heck is my... Okay, so I should be standing over here. And then there. Wow, that looks much more difficult. Hey! 12 exercises is still enough. <laughs> I like that I teleported. Imagine if I had to do that and like run to each. All right. I worked hard outside the you ring. Hard out of the ring to get here. To now, now fight, fight hard in the ring. In there and win. Come on. Cut. Dude. See? Apollo would do it. Punk. <clears throat> Rise to glory. The pre-creed creed. That's the creed of creed for his pre-creed creed. The main event is about to begin! Look at that mountain. What? Me? In the blue corner. I'm the mountain? Dwayne. No, no, no. You. You're Rhino the mountain. Reynolds! Ultimate underground champion? In the red corner, Adonis Hollywood Green! Yeah! Woo! 
Should I be nervous that he's called Rhino when I see no horn? Because that means that, uh... <clears throat> Ladies should be nervous. Yeah, I know how to walk. They both Is look I'm not doing it? win as the two contenders come out to touch gloves. Um, yeah, I'm super eager. Look at this. Does it take my real height or does it shrink me to... I don't know how tall Michael B. Jordan is. Let's get ready to fight! <sighs> this, this is... Let's keep this above the belt and inside the even, ring. Ready? I even start? The fight starts as soon as you touch... Okay. I've sad to make sure. Ah... <sighs> This is already terrible. The run. I'm gonna try Both not to cheat. Start to fill each other out. Ooh. Wait for an open. Ooh. Ooh. It looks Ooh. like he's going for the knockout. Ooh. One punch at a time. Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? Cheating. <laughs> Apparently. Reed staying on the defensive, keeping those hands. Reed drives a hard punch right through his opponent. Reed sends the opponent to the mat. Two. Three. Four. Oh. Reed delivers an absolutely devastating blow to his opponent. Probing for an opening. Oh, what a hit! Great fires off the bow that leaves One. his opponent wide open. Two, three, four, five, six. Ugh. Shit. Fucking it. Blocked 19%. Received two. I only received two hits and I felt like I was gonna die. Hey! Chip Army! No? Okay. What if I... Ah, uh, see? That you like. You like the cheater. Yeah! Yeah! Cheer for the dirty player! Except for you two, you, you come back to my room. Alright, fine, I'll put Goof enough. Eventually. Whee! I'm joking. Things happening all over the world this week. Where do we even begin? Well, there's local news and there's some stuff happening across the pond. What's happening here, Trav? What if I told you Rocky Balboa was coming out of retirement? We got another Mason Dixon situation on our hands? Uh, not quite. Think a little more Tommy Gunn. You know, I would prefer not to. <laughs> Rocky Balboa is back in the world of boxing, but not in the ring. His new fighter goes by the name of Donnie Johnson, a relative unknown, challenging Rocky's old gym this week. Wait a second here. Rocky's boy is fighting against Mighty Mix? That's right. He'll be doing a friendly sparring exhibition against Leo the Lion Sparino, the fist of Philly. The Bob Lion. Johnson. He's... Uh, that sounds familiar. Do we know this guy? Funny you should mention that. Yeah. It's been a few years, but he's that guy who took down the Rhino in Mexico a few years back. No way. A few years? Well, this guy has more staying power than Tommy Gunn did. They're saying he's got 15 wins, 15 knockouts. Sparino is good, but 
This kid might be the real deal. And with the Italian stallion in his corner, he's going to be a well-known fighting machine. We'll have all the news after that fight next. But for now, guess who's back in the news? Is it my favorite fighting Irishman? You guessed it. Scrappy. Conlon continues to oh. make headlines after his recent sentencing. Seven years for gun possession. And now his final fight before his prison date may be compromised. Conlon was set to fight Danny Stuntman. I like how even months, the but at the way in, both thing has the bump. Apparently, couldn't wait to get started. No. That's right, a brawl broke out, and Conlon broke the stuntman's jaw. Oh, so no we both must have started like off at Delphi. Guess is as good and then as he came crap. to Mighty Mix. That's the bell. You know what that means. This has been the distance with Nick and Travis. You all have a great week. Until the next round. So I don't actually think I've seen the Creed movies. I know the general story though. Uh, this is before the move, the very first movie. My rise to glory. Um, yeah. <sighs> I am just so exhausted after every one of these fights. It's only like a minute, minute and a half. But again, it's 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 going. It's that's why this is good. Good hit training. Like I said this used to be my cardio. Where'd you go, Rock? Did you leave? You leave because I'm embarrassing? Rocky! <sighs> Alright. Uh, I know that you're waiting. Thank you, Rock. I guess since I did a tour of the first, I'm going to do a quick tour of Mighty Mix, Slim Pickens, and Fitness Jamboree. So all these eventually have like an end point, except for the treadmill. The treadmill will just have you go and go and go. And mainly because I'm not sure whether or not I'm going to put up any of that warm-up video. Basically, all I did was come to, actually, I think Mighty Mix. I just came to Mighty Mix and I did some of the different exercises and stuff. And then I think I went around with scraps because it's, <laughs> it's scraps, I mean. Ah, uh, blah, oh. I am one with the bag. I am the ultimate boxer now. <clears throat> I feel like that meme of the little girl that's like, Go back to skiing. All right. Friendly, friendly match with Leo the Lion Sporino. My old. Oh, it's so loud. Oh, wow, it's so loud. I might have to, uh, I might have to watch that and see how my voice is compared to this because I cannot tell and it seems like it's quiet by comparison to me. This is like another RE7 scenario, but I'm going to turn it up then it's like blood of truth. I used to be able to play through and fight not any of the DLC guys like Rock and Apollo and Drago, etc., etc. Because those guys, those guys are freaking hard. Those guys are hard even on normal. So I have not been able to beat them on hard ever, even when I was doing it all the time. I don't even know if I'm going to show any of this. This is just a test for my volume and try to remember how to play. Um, nothing's things happening can I I can't punch the <sighs> it's broken already because I haven't played in so long I wanted to kind of 
Okay. I can't even do this one in real life. Okay, so... Seems to be losing... Below the belt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Except I'm doing it again. Stupid treadmill is the one I dislike the most, but it's probably the most important because it's how you freaking get back up. Why is 
poison, huh? So it doesn't really care if you alternate them or not. You just basically have to... doesn't seem like it wants to end, so. Is there a crouch? Do I just... Did I just say eight stamps away from a... Live it up for a few seconds, cameras. That's a knockdown. Two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six. You! You! Did it for you. And, and you. To the dressing room! Uh, 20 is a lot. I did throw a few when he was already blocking. Oh, but I only took three attacks. Scraps. I guess I can't be too excited, but not bad for a first match back. Of course, it was just supposed to be a warm up, and it's on normal, and he's the easiest. I can't remember if I disabled rounds or not, but I'm glad it was less than a round. That's always. <sighs> yeah. Okay. I'm not sure when I'm going to start this, but. Yeah, rock! Get it, dude. You know you missed, right? Flam! Can I... Can I walk up on you and start shit? Am I, am I allowed to... No. It's the ghost of rock. Is this he's my inspiration right now? Is that what this is? And then boom, he tags me in the back of the head. What the hell, Rock? Why? Ooh, I definitely need to make it cooler in my apartment. I forgot about this. That's part of why this was like my cardio thing back in the day, is cause even after a few fights, as long as you turn off the rounds so you don't actually get that break, um, 
as long as you turn off the rounds, it is. It is quite the workout. Let's see if I do any more one-offs or 